Hi, it's Nick from Nick's Nutrition, and as you can probably tell, I'm in a different background. I'm with Sai from the Dark Kitchen. Hi guys. We basically have challenged each other to come up with two healthy autumn slash winter recipes that are perfect for either bonfire night or Halloween. They're based on basically orange ingredients, so we've got some carrots going on, we've got some pumpkin. So once you've checked out my video, go over to Sai's channel, The Dark Kitchen, and go check out his recipe. So if you head over to my channel, you'll see Nick, the familiar face, in one of my videos. It will be up at the same time, right? Yes. Yeah, and I'm making overnight pumpkin pie oats. On my channel, we're going to be making no-bake carrot cake bites. I really didn't know what to call this recipe but it tastes amazing so let's get started let's do this so we're going to start with 10 pitted medjool dates so Sai is going to help me peel these just to get the stone out and then I'm just going to add half a cup of walnuts which is about 70 grams you can use any other chopped nut though and then in this bowl we've got half a cup of I've got ground linseed but you can use ground almond and Sai is going to add the spice And then we're just going to add two pre-grated carrots and then all we're going to do, and I'll let Sai do this bit because this is his blender, is <laughs> whiz everything up. So the mixture is all pulverised and it should look something like this. And all we're going to take is take scoops of the mixture out, roll it into a bowl and pop it on the plate and they're going to go in the fridge. So we've got one of your five a day going in there, the carrots, fantastic source of vitamin A. We've got healthy fats from the nuts. We've got some natural sweetness from the dates. And then we've got some more healthy fats from the ground flax seeds, or you can use ground almonds. So rolling these in desiccated coconut is completely optional, but if you do, just make sure to go for the unsweetened variety. So we're gonna pop these in the fridge for about 15 minutes, and then we're gonna give them a taste test. So here we have the final carrot cake balls. They were super easy to make, weren't they, Sai? Yeah, yeah. Sai decided to decorate some of them with desiccated coconut and with some with left plain. So... If you'd like coconut or not. We're going to do a bit of a taste test now. What's the coconut one? This is a plain one. Well done, Nick. Mm. They taste pretty damn good. Mm. Sai so was in charge of the spices, so I think that... Yeah, they taste good. Yeah, good spices? Mm. So add how much I put in. <laughs> I don't taste one with that coconut. Oh, I'll do one with the coconut. Mm. I actually prefer it with the coconut. Mm, yeah, but it's really nice. Mm. I'll put all the information about calories, carbs, protein and fat on my blog, which is nixnutrition.com and I'll link it down below. Thank you so very much for helping me out in this recipe. Go check out Sai's um, amazing recipe, it tastes incredible. And then comment down below telling us which recipe you like the most. So either the no bake carrot cake bites or Sai's pumpkin overnight protein oats. So please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe and I'll look forward to seeing you next week. Cheers guys. Bye. I call them like carrot cake balls. Carrot cake bites. What do I call them? Um, Car no bake carrot cake bites. No bake carrot cake balls. Yeah. Um, you've got quite a mature audience, so I'm sure you can call them balls and get away with it. <laughs> okay, I'll go with bites. <laughs>